So in this first video, in a series of videos, what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay down a problem for you guys to try and solve. It's a programming challenge. It's basically implementing a C function. And uh, I'll, we'll, I will give you the problem statement in this video. And then what we're going to do in the next videos is try to answer them. I'm going to walk you through the solution to this question. But what I want you to do is, after you've seen this video, I want you to try it out on your own. And uh, if you can't solve it, give it a try. If you can't solve it, then we'll work it out together. And even if you can't solve it, check your solution against mine. So essentially what I'm doing is, I'm, g I'm giving you a singly linked list. And uh, I'm telling you that uh, you have access to a head and tail pointers, so they're global pointers, you could use them anywhere in your functions, and uh, the head of course points to the head of the function, uh, the head of the linked list, and the tail points to the tail of the linked list, the last element of the linked list, and um, I'm asking you to implement a function which removes one of the elements in the linked list, and this is the prototype that I want for it, so int remove element, so essentially, we would pass in an element to that function, a pointer to an element, and it would if it would look through your linked list and try to find that element. If it finds it, then it will remove it, and it will return zero, as in it completed successfully. If it could not find the element, it will return a one. So I want you to implement that function, and keep in mind that you're going to have to update the head and tail pointers. So they're actually called head and tail, and I want them updated. So if you're going to remove the first element in the linked list, you're going to have to update the head. If you're going to remove the last element in the linked list, you're going to have to update the tail. So implement this function in C. And this is the problem statement. And also the linked list um, is basically a list of uh, integers. So every node in the... Uh, so this is essentially the node. Type def struct element. one pointer, so a struct element, next, and so a pointer to the next element in the list, and we're going to have the data itself, so int data. So it's a linked list of integers, so this is the data that we're keeping in the linked list, and every node, so this is the definition of a node, it's a structure, and every node has a next pointer, it points to the next element in the list. So I'm giving you that, and I'm telling you, I want you to implement this remove function where I pass in a pointer to one of the elements in the list. You have to look for that element, find it, remove it, and then relink the list and update the head and tail pointers. So that is the challenge for you.